I think the title of this episode perfectly displays what's going to happen. The Lightning of Rage, a.k.a. Pastry, or the Elf's Hatred of Humans, and the Rage versus Friends, Magna and Vanessa. I am not looking forward to this episode. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with episode 104 of Black Clover. Last episode, we had Asta and Yuno successfully save Hodge from their attacking elf reincarnate. And with that, we are on our way to the capital to see what else we can do for the resistance, help out around places, you know, just all that goodness that they, the Magic Knights and themselves do. But we also have Magna practicing training with Vanessa. And then we have Luck, who's about to jump out of their mobile headquarters and wreak havoc. And I know that's what these next two episodes are going to be about at the least. I'm really nervous. I hope everything works out, especially because Magna doesn't even know what's going on with the reincarnation. No one really does. Like, it's, it's, it's a secret and surprise. And it's, it's hitting real hard. So let's find out what happens. I am very excited. Don't forget, if you guys want early access or full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead on Patreon. Links are down in the description down below for you guys, like always. Don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop into this. Black Clover, episode 104, Lightning of Rage versus Friends. Let's do this. I won't lie, Luck does look damn badass though, <laughs> with all that power and, and his uh, lightning form. And there's going to be some crazy moments and some crazy fights coming up, I can already tell. Very much looking forward to it. Yeah, Luck could kill so many people. You can feel what kind of the body wants. That's crazy. Rufil. Mmm, Vanessa would know a little bit. Yep, Vanessa, especially with the, the witch. Yeah. The witch queen, all that. Did he miss again because Luck also didn't want to hit Magna? Yep. Now, I love how they keep playing these little teasers like the body who's being taken over by the elf souls still have the smallest bit of control. Like Klaus was able to feel like his body didn't want to attack Asta. Um, the other member of the Crimson Lions, when Leona was attacking, he said the body himself felt scared. You know, William and Patry, he, uh, he said William was crying on the inside. And Luck missed Noel. And he, and uh, well, I, I need to write down the elf's name as well, even though I don't think they're going to be here for too long, but I definitely should. He was uh, he was like, oh, it hasn't been a, it's been a long time since I used my power. That's why I missed. But then Noel was like, had a feeling that it was because Luck didn't want to hit her. So this is, I love that little, that little tease they're doing. Oh, or it's just the red cat of fate. The red. Oh, okay. I'm just an idiot. That whole conversation I just had was for nothing. Meow. <laughs> Such a cute cat. Mm. So the red threat of fate is even gonna protect Luck just because he's a part of the Black Bulls. Is a part of its like. Directive. Mm. Explosive annihilation scatter shot. Ooh. I won't lie, that looks super dope. Quick thinking, Vanessa. Always there with the clutch, that thread magic. She's been the GOAT support since the beginning. Since the underwater temple. Time bomb, okay. I love how he's coming out with all sorts of variations of his main spell. For certain situations, certain attributes. That animation was snapping too. Ooh, 
Oh, 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 he is quick. Little hand grenade scatter shot. Damn. Yeah. Touche. Touche. Gargantuan exploding fireball. Ooh. That was a great attack. Okay, Magna. Max, you tell him. Tell him, Magna. What is he, Pikachu? Gonna do down B? Oh, he's definitely doing a down B. That's literally a down B. Oh, awesome. If there's any indication of where you need to go, it's right there. Let's see it. He's even getting another form upgrade? Oh my god. This man literally looks like a god. Like, if I saw him, I would think he's the lightning god. Like, this form looks dope. Man, if only Julius were still around. Julius would probably be one of the only people who could handle luck with this speed relatively easily. No, the red thread. Oh. Yeah, the red thread. Another one. Another one. He's killing Magnet over and over and over again. We're gonna have to think of something to do. It's like six or seven deaths right there. Vanessa's gonna be out of magic here in a second. Oh, they are exhausted. You tell them, Magna. Come on, please. Let's try to reason, you know? Access that inner spirit. Come on. You, well, I mean, I get what you're saying, but yes, you don't know humans that well. Lux crying. Lux in there. Absolutely. Oh, okay, Vanessa, what are you going to do? Asta, what's going to happen? What is that tied to? Where is that going? Is that the goat? Is that the goat coming in? Oh, good cut. Literally the exact timing. Is it pronounced Rogue or Rouge? Rouge. The cat's name. A single one. Not not a single one. He's gonna turn at the last second. Oh yeah, like all badasses do in this situation. <laughs> okay, Asta. I love this like 3D background they're doing. Like, you could see him jump over the edge and like fall back and shit. Like, look at this. This is dope. So literally end from Hunter Hunter. I love that concept in any show. But with the support, with the support squad. Oh, clutch. Missed your shots. And then propel us forward with that. Oh my god, bro. Yeah, if there's one thing that are if there's one thing that's gonna beat your rage, it's our bond, our friendship. Come on. I know, these guys are blessed by mana. 
Jesus. Everyone pile on top of him, dog pile style. <sighs> okay. Thank the Lord I'm watching the next episode right now. Can you guys imagine how dope a turn-based team JRPG would be with, like, the Black Bulls? Like, you could make your own party depending on what boss or what quest you're going on in certain situations. Certain teams would do so much better. Like, it'd be so dope. Like, at first, my go-to team, especially after watching the anime, would be, like, Asta Finral Vanessa. But Asta Vanessa Magna also make a fantastic squad. You know, you could have, like, a, a tank attack unit, like Yami, with Ghosh as a... Like, that, like, someone needs to get on that, man. That would be sweet. I would play the shit out of that game. This has literally made me think of that. Because you have Asta just doing this, and yet... So, Vanessa's been one of the best supports since the Underwater Temple. She's been so legendary with that thread. She can use like a thread thing, up your evasiveness and your speed, you know, oh my god, so dope. That is super dope. You can have like a combo spell just like you did right here. This fight, Luck is super strong, not even funny. He, that speed, that lightning is just insane, you know, his ability to dodge everything. The animation in this episode was also fantastic. I love how... Um, how much clutch Vanessa came in. I love seeing Magna's new upgraded scatter shots. You know, he had one that could, uh, one that was the Annihilation one, which just looked like it disappeared, like the Vanishing one, and then just exploded. And then he had the Timed one, which was super dope. And then he had the Gargantuan one. You know, he's just the scatter shot lord. This man's a baseball phenom. And you had Vanessa with her threads always coming in clutch. And is it Rogue? Because I believe Rogue is R-O-G-U-E, right? Versus this one, which is like Rouge, I believe, R-O-U-G-E. I, you know, I've never been the best when it comes to English or spelling. So if you guys could just let me know how it's pronounced, I'd really appreciate that. But it came in also Mad Clutch, the Red Thread of Fate. No doubt in my mind, Magna would have died multiple times had it not been for the Red Thread. So shouts out everyone. You gotta work in tandem. I love how the one thing that's going to beat out the elf's rage is going to be our Black Bull's bond and our closeness with each other because they will not let a single one of them be taken. I love how Asta said, when no one else would accept me, the Black Bulls would, so I won't let you take a single one. Love that to death. Very excited for this next episode. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you are, let me know what you thought down in the comments below. Please leave a like on this video. If you guys don't want to wait for the next bunch of episodes or you want to watch these in the full length, check out that Patreon. Links are in the description down below, like always, for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Follow all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much, much appreciated. Drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Be safe out there. Peace out, Dapper Squad.